look at this, this esteemed portrait in Trinity College, Cambridge, the most illustrious of Cambridge colleges, founded by Henry VIII, getting a good washing, a good coating of graffiti, red graffiti, ah, oh, and a bit of a Stanley knife addition too, that's lovely. You can even see the frame in the background getting absolutely tattered. Portraits of Lord Balfour, the former Prime Minister at the University of Cambridge, has been damaged by a pro-Palestinian protester. In a video posted on social media by Palestine Action, a member of the group is seen spray painting and slashing the portraits at Trinity College. A woman can be seen defacing the work with red paint before slicing the canvas with a sharp object. Balfour was one of the chief supporters of creating a Jewish homeland in Palestine, cemented by the Balfour Declaration of 1917, which gave British backing to the movement. The, a nephew of Lord Salisbury, he succeeded his uncle as Prime Minister in 1902 and subsequently became Foreign Secretary. The Instagram video was accompanied by a caption that read, Palestine Action Spray and Slash, a historic painting of so-called Lord Balfour at, in Trinity College, Cambridge. Written in 1917, Balfour's declaration began the ethnic cleansing of Palestine. This is a quote, uh, by promising the land away, uh, which the British never had the right to do. After the declaration, until 1948, the British burnt down indigenous villages to prepare the way. With this came arbitrary killings, arrests, torture, and sexual violence, including rape. The British paid the way for the Nakba and trained the Zionist militia to ethnically cleanse over 750,000 Palestinians, destroy over 500 villages and massacre many families. The Nakba never stopped, and the genocide today is rooted and supported by British complicity. Now, Elbit Systems, Israel's biggest weapons manufacturer, uses Britain as a manufacturing outpost to build arms which are battle-tested on Palestinians. A Trinity College spokesman said, Trinity College regrets the damage caused to a portrait of Arthur James Balfour during public opening hours. The police have been informed. Support is available for any member of the college community affected. A the spokesman for Cambridge Police said, This afternoon we received an online report of criminal damage today to a painting at Trinity College, Cambridge. Officers are attending the scene to secure evidence and progress the investigation. No arrests have been made at this stage. Palestine Action were contacted for comments.